Most of you probably know what life in the city is like. But this little story is about different places and bigger things. No, it's a big story about a different kind of little thing. A little leafy sea dragon called Gavin. Ah, oh, look! There are two moons tonight. It's a plastic bag, Gavin. Where's it from? It's a big world out there. Don't you ever wonder what's out there? Hmm, sometimes. But you know that leafies don't normally go very far from home. Besides, it's winter. Gavin, we don't have to start a family till spring. I'm ready to explore. Oh, how do you know when you're ready? Come on, Gavin, grow up. It'll be wicked. <sighs> wicked. <sighs> Keep your lips off that, Cody. I said get back here, Cheryl. Oh, no, there's no need to spill your guts about it. Oh, I guess I'll have a family one day. I wish I were braver, like Astrid. You are brave. What? But you do need to get out a bit more. Broaden your horizons. I don't know if I'm ready. Look, son, I've got a bit of a tip for you. Us leafies can travel up to 100 metres from home and still get back to the same spot we started from. How? We have a built-in navigation system. Not there. It's in here. Oh, wait! Wait! What do, you, what, what do you mean? Trust the system, son. It will always get you home. And trust me, one thing about girls as they'll always let you know when they're ready. I'm ready. What for? To see the world. What about spring? What about having a family? Trust the system. What are you waiting for? Get out of here. Trust the system. Hey, wait for me. Astrid! These are sea sponges, and these are sea squirts. And that's a couple of lures? No, they're nudibranchs. They're invertebrates. What does that mean? It means we've got no backbone, man. How do you get around? We just... chuff. You think we're slow? Those sea sponges over there multiply without even moving. <laughs> Come on, Gavin. We've got so much to see. What's the hurry, man? Oh, it's been nice to meet you both, but I've really got to go. Unusual, man. They move fast. For a couple of leaves. <laughs> you see, on Tuesday, on Tuesday, that's right, Florence said, oh, well, and I never, I've been up and down this beach all my life. And I bet you've never seen one of those before. I say, oh. Not looking too comfy, are they? No. No. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh, yes. This is on Tuesday. And Florence, Florence yeah. yeah. Florence. Astrid! Astrid, where are you? I'm right here. Where? <gasps> That's what old man Leafy did. <gasps> How do you do it? It's camouflage. We can all do it. You try. <laughs> See, you did it. You look like the kelp. It says here that kelps are very strong because they live in rough environments and have to survive vigorous water movements. And these forests are home to hundreds of sea creatures. Really? Storm coming in! Everybody down! Oh. <laughs> 
Astrid, is that you? We may be small, dear man. Actually microscopic, but that doesn't mean you have to ignore us. I can't even see you. That's because we're bacteria. I don't think we can't see you though. I must say, that is a lovely outfit you've got on. Wow. I've changed colour. Anyway, can't chat all day. We've got nutrients to recycle. Funny. It can't be night time already. You must be brave out here all alone. <gasps> oh, I didn't see you there. How could you miss us? We're southern right whales. What about you, little horsey? I'm not a horse. I'm a leafy sea dragon. We're related to the seahorse family, actually. We're unique. Leafies aren't found anywhere else in the world. And what are you doing here? I've got to find my friend. I need to get home, back to Rapid Bay. We can help him, can't we, Mum? It's too early for us to leave the nursery. But we can take him as far as Marat. That's it, little Leafy. You're on your own. Just past those surfers at the headland and keep heading southeast. Woo! Thank you. Ah, oh, Cheryl! Oh, I had that. Oh, geez, Cheryl! Shut up. Shush now. Hi, guys. Uh, do you know how I can get back to. Oh, oh, I know who you are. I've heard stories about you. You can't eat me. I'm the marine emblem of South Australia. I'm protected. <laughs> Relax, horsey. Me too. We're like the rest of you, just getting by. Anyway, I prefer seals. It's a size thing. But I'm not even supposed to be here. I've got to get home. Hey, perk up, shorty. You only live once. Got to make the best of what you got. And hey, look what we've got. What a place. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, strange looking seals. Oh, terrible stuff. Whoa. Oh, did you feel that, kiddo? No. <laughs> What an electrical charge, baby. It means dinner's close. And your eyes open. Yeah, your lips oh, your eyes open. Snapper. Gotta go, kiddo. Grubs up. Yeah, baby. Navigation. Us leafies can all do it. Okay. Here goes. Trust the system, Gavin. Trust the system? Oh, yeah. That trusty old system. Just do it, Gavin. Astrid does it all the time. Yeah. Astrid. I've got to get back to Astrid. I've seen you before. I'm not a horse. I'm a sea dragon. Yada, whatever. We're giant cuddle. We're here to spawn, you know, lay a few eggs. We normally hang out by ourselves further out to sea. But you're in luck. This little get together only happens once a year. Yeah, who's your little friend, Camellia? Yeah, who's that guy that he thing? I'm Gavin. Too, Too deadly. deadly. Don't be a stranger. Why don't you come join our party? <laughs> Thanks, really, but I've got to get home. See ya. I wish everyone would stop leaving me like that. Now, where was I? I think I'll turn left. No, right. Maybe it's left. It's no use. Yeah, yeah, you're not from around here? Uh, no, I'm from Rapid Bay. Oh, not a bad distance. <laughs> See, we tuna are born and bred in northern waters. Catch the Liu and current right around the west coast of Australia. 
Why do you come all this way? Oh, to grow up. Lots of food. We like the climate. We're travellers just like you. Oh, do you mind if I take a picture for the album? I seem to have lost my travelling companions. I hate to hold you up. Oh. oh, there's no need to worry. I've just spent a few days feeding at the Continental Shelf. Is that a restaurant? No, it's where the edge of Australia drops off underwater. You know a lot about the world, like Astrid. I have done a bit of travelling, but now I'm heading home past Backstairs Passage. I live near there too. That's where all the colourful animals with no backbone are. We're called Nudie Branks, horsey. Are you really going that way? Yes, to the Pages Conservation Park, our main breeding colony, a protected environment. As it happens, the Australian sea lion is a protected species. Me too, I'm protected, like the great white shark and the southern right whales. Yeah, some of us are these days. It's good they decided to keep us around for the future. Who decided? Hold your breath. <laughs> Not long now, Astrid. I'm talking about Gavin. He's on his way. Oh, I don't know if I can wait. Trust the system. It will bring him home. We're pretty close now. Can you make it from here? As a matter of fact, I've got a built-in navigational system. Yes, I think you'll be fine. Home. So close. I can feel it in my tail. I hope Astrid will be there. And indeed Astrid is there. But not before going on a journey of her own. You see, the storm took Astrid elsewhere. But that's another big story about different things. Astrid. Astrid, are you there? You've changed. Oh, you too. I knew you'd make it home. Looks like I'm just in time for the handover. Ready? Mm-hmm. Right. My, look at the time. Uh, I'll just be going then. It's a big world out there, kiddos. Sharks, they're okay. Unless they're really hungry and you happen to look like a seal. But whales, now they're big. Try and guess how much they eat. Don't let anyone call you a horsey. Sorry, man. No, we're not horses. We're dragons. Little sea dragons, yes we are. 